please like and subscribe. Let's grow in AI basketball. Thank you. Cascade Hoops Talk, bringing the world NAI basketball one podcast at a time. Cascade Hoops Talk, this is Billy D. Well, there wasn't a ton of games last night. First off, welcome to Wednesday. Guess what happens today? Yes, there's new ratings come out. Next guess. Yes, Grace is going up to Marion and they're going to play Indiana Wesley in, in Lucky Arena. So if you're not excited about that, I don't know how much hope there is for you. But that's going to happen today. But also the new rankings come out. Uh, best way to get them quick is on your Twitter. Just put a uh, alert or whatever they call it, uh, tweet alert on NAI uh, Twitter page. And, it, you know, they, they usually put them out about, I don't know, between 7.30 and 9 Pacific time. So, you know, whatever time that is for you local. But those will be out today. As you guys know, I'm not a huge fan of the top 25. I know it comes into play at tournament time, but I think it's more of a beauty contest. I like to concentrate on the conferences. So tonight, a uh, little bit of action in the Sooner Conference. Uh, Segu. Uh, they took on UNT Dallas. They beat them uh, 93-68. Uh, uh, Cortland Blake, look at this. 30 points, 9 rebounds. C.J. Hall, 22 points, 6 rebounds, 8 assists, filling up the stat line. So Sagu, they go to 14-6, and six, and they get another shot at Langston, but this time at Waxahachie. So we'll see how that goes on Thursday. In the Mid-South, one non-conference game. Freed Hardman, they took care of business. They beat Oakwood. Uh, J.J. Wheat, he had 10 points, as did Quan Lax. They go to 18-3. and three. They're going to play Bethel on Saturday. Going over to the Red River. Uh, LSU Shreve, tonight was the night of almost an upset. So many games were almost an upset. Uh, but LSU Shreveport, they took care of business on the road, they beat Texas A&M, Texarkana. Tyler Washington, 22 points, 9 rebounds, just missing the double-double. Jordan DeCure, 19 points. The Pilots, they go to 15-4, and four, and they're going to play Our Lady of the Lake on Thursday. Over to the River States, quite a bit of action. Full slate over at the River States tonight. Point Park, they get win number 20. They go to 20-2. 20 Jalen Stamps, 26 points, 6 rebounds. Nathaniel Van, double-double, 12 points, 12 rebounds. This was a tight game. They ended up winning this game. Of course, it's on the road at Ohio Christian, but they took care of business. They won this game 75-72, but uh, it was a dogfight. So Point Park, they're going to play West Virginia Tech at West Virginia Tech on uh, Saturday. Let's take a look at the the rest of the River States tonight. As I said, it was a... A full night, double overtime in Kokomo. Chris Chin, he had uh, 24 points, 11 rebounds for the double-double. Big Max Newman, he pulled in 18 rebounds, but he also had a double-double, and IU Kokomo survives the scare. Looking here at Shawnee State, uh, they also had a real, there was a really tight game tonight. Uh, Tyreek Johnson, 20 points, 7 assists, 5 rebounds, and he led Shawnee State to the big win. And, of course, another important game there in the, the River State, St. Mary of the Woods, 87-77. Kobe Barnes, uh, he had 29 points, 9 rebounds uh, in this game. So, uh, you know, a lot of big action in the uh, River State. So, St. Mary of the Woods, they... Uh, go to 10 and one. They're a, point, a game up on Point Park and Shawnee State. And then hanging back right there, just one game back is West Virginia Tech. So not a ton of action tonight. Uh, don't forget tomorrow we have, or sorry, tonight we have Grace and Indiana Wesleyan and then new rankings come out. Enjoy your day and enjoy your basketball tonight. This is Billy D. Goodbye. 
Thank you very much for supporting our podcast. Please like and subscribe. Get out to your local NAI school because NAI basketball is the best entertainment value in America. 